Now for the construction of the new table value, we have the theta is equal to 3. So if a value has multiple lines over it, we have to add the theta value with it. If there is only a single line on a particular value, we have to just write as it is without in, without involving the theta value. With the, all the other values, which does not have any other line, we have to subtract it. So the first value is 5. Since it has two lines on top of it, I'm going to add 3 with it, which will be 5 plus 3, 8. And 0, it has only single line on top of it, I'll write as it is, 8 also. 10 has two lines over it, so it will be 13. 11 as it is. Here we have only single line, so it is 0. 8 plus 3 will be 11. Single line 0. Single line 3. Again here we have another single line, it will be 0. Two lines, so it will be 3. Single line 2. Single line 0. Again we have another single line here, so uh, 5, 0. We have already added and it is again 0. The rest of the values we have to subtract it with 3. So 6 minus 3 will be 3. 15 minus 3 will be 12. 3 minus 3 0. And then uh, 6 minus 3 3. 4 minus 3 1. 7 minus 3 4. 5 minus 3 2. 6 minus 3 3. 8 minus 3 5. After getting the new tabl tabular column we have to again allocate the cells as we did before. In the first row we have only 1 0. So I'm allocating it and it does not intersect so there's no problem and in the second row I have three zeros so I'm ignoring it in the third row also I have two zeros so I'm ignoring it and in the fourth row I have only one zero suppose if I allocate this one it does not intersect with any other uh, cells any other allocated cells so I'm allocating it and in the last row I have one zero if suppose I allocate it it, do it does not have any other allocated cells so there will be no issues I am allocating it now I am going through the column wise first column already has one cell allocated to it so no issues second column also has another allocated cell in the third column I have one zero suppose if I allocate this one there are no other allocated cells so I am assigning it to it fourth row already has an allocated zeros and in the fifth row I have two zeros suppose if I allocate this one there are no other allocated cell, uh, cells beside it or on top of it. So I am allocating this one. Now I can assign each mechanic to each machine. That is the first mechanic is assigned to the second machine. Second mechanic is assigned to the fifth machine. Third mechanic is assigned to the third machine. Fourth mechanic is assigned to the first machine. Fifth mechanic is assigned to the fourth machine. So the total value which will be obtained from the original tabular column will be since the first mechanic is assigned to the second machine, which will be 15. Second mechanic to the fifth machine, which will be 19. Third mechanic to the third machine, which will be 14. Fourth mechanic to the first machine, which will be 14 again. And fifth, fifth mechanic to the fourth machine, which will be 11. By summing up all these values, we will get a value of 73. So this will be the final result. Thank you.